Hey, it's Faye. BTS came out with some blackhead strips through BT21 from the cream shop. Where was that? BTS strips? Come. It's supposed to help remove blackheads, whiteheads, excessive oil, and dirt. I'm very curious to see how much my nose can poop. You got to be shit me. Not gonna lie, my nose looks pretty good. I'm not expecting a lot of shine. Who knows? My nose is hairy, that's for sure. I do see some problematic hose out here. Oof. I feel like if I squeeze it, it could just gush out, so let's not do that right now. Let's use one of these. Wow! They're so cute! Obviously gonna use Cookie. Bye bye Blackhead. Honestly, I don't have high expectations. I know this is BT21. I've tried a lot of their products when they first came out with a bunch of beauty products and I'm not a huge fan of their things. I go, wow. It was great, but it wasn't BTS status. Not me. Oh. Look how cute the strip is. It has a basketball. That's cookie. Okay, we gotta wet our nose. It's pretty dry, feels a little flaky. Oh, spoke too soon. Again, I have really low expectations right now. This is so cute though. I'm just gonna press on it until I feel it sturdy. Okay, the adhesion is pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Feels really sticky already. I'm skeptical, a hater almost. But then again, I'm like a huge BT21 and the Cream Shop fan, plus BTS. I guess I'm just skeptical. So cute. It's like on the tip of your nose, a sexy tap. Bruh. Okay, now we're just gonna wait 10 to 15 minutes. We'll come back and check out Cookie and the Hookie. Uh, I feel like a grandma. I mean, look at my outfit. I don't wanna do anything. Okay, now it's time to peel this bitch off. The correct way to peel a blackhead strip, we all know, is from bottom to top. We're gonna do it. And we're not gonna complain, we're just gonna go for it. <gasps> It doesn't hurt that bad. So when BTS was making this, they thought about our feelings. Oh, just kidding. Maybe I spilled this in. Not bad. Okay, I'm just gonna peel the kooky tip off. There's little cuts in between the strips to help conform around your nose shape, but I find it really helpful to just kind of like use that as a guide to peel your shit off. Ooh, wow, it doesn't hurt at all. Okay, we're just gonna go for it. That was way too easy. Oh, that didn't hurt at all. Except, ew. I just picked this out of my nose myself. It did not pull everything out 100%. But there's just a lot of like half ass sebaceous filaments kind of like hanging off the tip of my nose. And threatening. I'm gonna scrape my nose. Do you see? A bunch of shit just came out. Wreck! Ew, that's huge. You see that? I don't know if you can tell. Yes, I'm rubbing it on my leg. Mm -hmm. <gasps> what the heck? So basically this strip just loosened everything up and it's like pretty much 50% dangling off my nose. I'm not disappointed. I do see a bunch of shit on this strip and I have this long piece of hair. I'd say for the most part it grabbed a lot of the easier, bigger sebaceous filaments kind of ready to go, RIP. It half-assed a lot of the sebaceous filaments around the sides of my nose. That sucker came off flawlessly. The most gentle blackhead strip I've ever used, given that it slid off that easily, the turnout's not horrible. I can't say it's the best blackhead strip I've ever used because this strip wasn't able to dig into to the sides of my nose, especially in the harder spots here. It's cute. So the Creme Shop at BT21 Bye Bye Blackhead Strips do leave a residue around your nose like so, so you do have to wash that off. I'm not shocked that it wasn't as gruesome on the nose. However, I am pretty surprised that it's very gentle on the nose because I'm a crybaby. Like, my pain tolerance, you guys know, died when I was born. Oh, I just keep like pricking my own shit out. Look how nasty that is. Ew. I mean, at least it brought my sebaceous filaments to surface. Gross. <laughs> oh my god, don't even get me started on the side. Ew. It's all ballsy. Do you see this amount? That was disgusting. I hope you don't unsubscribe. But I understand. Uses a blackhead strip but ends up pricking her own nose. You know. Look at that. Oh 
god. So if you're looking for a strip that's pretty minute, like on a scale of one to five out of two, these are for you. No shame, no shade, okay? I've tried way stronger blackhead strips, which can be pretty damaging on your skin. So if you want to do something that's safer, I highly recommend these. Why not? For like a girl's night or something. And if you're gonna use blackhead strips pretty frequent, then these are the ones to go for. Now, if you're looking for something stronger that you do once in a while, check out my other blackhead videos. On that note, that's my quick review on the BT21 Bye Bye Blackhead. I'll leave the link down below. I don't think you can really see a before and after difference anyway, so take it as it is. The mowers are out, so I guess this is my cue to exit myself. Like this video for more blackhead skincare shart, and until next time, I'm sending love. Bye. Even if you try, you wouldn't understand.